Welcome back to JTS Astrophotography. Tonight is the big night of the great conjunction of Jupiter and Saturn. Tonight is December 20th. It's going to be the last chance I get to see it because uh, tomorrow is going to be cloudy. I'm running the big rig here with the Skywatcher 127 Maxitov and the Skywatcher Star Adventure. I am using the monochrome um, ZWO 120mm Mini. Um, it's going to be a black and white picture, but I'm uh, going to get a color camera soon, but that's, that's what I'm going to be using tonight. And according to Stellarium, um, that camera sensor with no Barlow uh, will fit the two planets in one field of view. So should be a really great picture of the conjunction of Jupiter and Saturn. I'm also using my stock DSLR on a photo tripod to get some wide field shots of it as well. And I'll probably switch this over to some visual use as well to capture it with my own eyes. So uh, hopefully everything will go well. I'm gonna be sort of crunched for time because um, it's gonna be low in the sky and uh, moving quickly. So hopefully I'll get it up and running and going good and get it done quickly because um, I don't have a lot of time to spare. Other than that, uh, hopefully everything will go good. Uh, the last time this has happened was uh, 1200, the year 1200. So it's been 800 years since uh, Jupiter and Saturn has been this close, and it will happen again in 2080. It happens every 20 years, but this is the closest it's been since 1200. So. Uh, this is a once-in-a-lifetime thing, other than 2008. <laughs> Alright, uh, the sun has set, and I'm waiting for it to uh, get dark enough to start seeing Jupiter and Saturn. I have focused my telescope on the moon with the camera using this 3D printed uh, Batonov mask. I already have it going on SharpCat. So as soon as I can see it pop out, I'm gonna go over there and frame up on it and see how it is. Hopefully uh, this will catch it all in one frame. If not, I can always switch to my Xena Star 61 with a 2X Barlow and see what that does. But uh, everything will be going pretty quick because it looks like it's gonna be around 20, 25 degrees above more like around 20 uh, when it gets dark dark so hopefully everything will go well I'll do a rough polar alignment uh, with the star adventure so we will see okay so Jupiter and Saturn will be somewhere right right in there uh, once it gets dark enough to see it's right out the southwest um, corner of the front yard so it should be a good area to capture them. <laughs> 